I think one of the most important things about all of this is that you feel comfortable. I don't mean just beautiful, comfortable. I think the more comfortable a woman feels on her wedding day, the more beautiful she is. Oh, this is so exciting! I mean the cookies, not that. No, okay. Oh, <laughs> not the wedding, <laughs> not Idris. Mira, Whoa. thank you so much. I'm so so happy to do this with you. That's the best well, part. I think it. you're one of the most charming people I've ever spoken to. Am I hitting on you? I think I. <laughs> Not quite. And it's so great to finally meet you in person and to be a part of this day because there's really nothing quite like it. And of course, um, <laughs> she's getting over it. It takes a little bit of time. They but. must stay away. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, it's really, really exciting to have you in New York and I cannot wait to start this with you. I find that a lot of my brides, when they're going through this process in couture, they fall in love with the slip first, the underpinning. Really? Because there are slips made that are just flawless. And they say, well, I'll just wear this. And I say, well, you can't. There's a whole dress that goes on top. <laughs> but that goes to show it's all the detail. It starts from the bottom, the inside Absolutely, out. Absolutely, from the inside out. Yeah, and we have sketches. We should take a look for Sabrina. <laughs> Oh my gosh. This is exactly like when I had envisioned and we had had this conversation yes. about this, this is exactly what I was talking about. I do want to discuss with you a little bit about the actual ceremony. Yeah. Are you going to be walking down an extremely long aisle? Because it's important mm. for me to know for the train. I think it'd be very dramatic to do, the um, to do a very long train. So I'm just thinking now that I've really met you in person, I think it would be just incredible. I love that. And then I like the back as well. Go, so Hela's not going to want to hear this. She's my head of couture. But to go sort of semi-strapless and then right. almost backless takes incredible construction. We will go as low as we can in the back because I think it'd be heaven with the long train. Amazing. I love I love that. the tension between skin yeah. and fabric. Idris has a tattoo on his arm that says, um, no wrongdoers on this train. Right. And I was wondering if we what if oh we stitched God. that on the train? Love it. As like love a surprise. Something like that. Love that. Yeah. So and then we could play around with the, the veil as well. Oh absolutely. The veil is leave that to me. I'm the ultimate veil cutter. This is a, yeah, this is a process. Right. This is a fun process. That is the fun process, definitely. It's more fun than choosing the plate. <laughs> <laughs> Are we allowed to go into the uh, party dress? Well, this is a whole nother thing. It's, it's sensual, really seductive. And I thought about even doing sort of like a waist where the fabric on top falls over a little bit. Yes, like Have a you cowl. Seen that before? Yeah, I think that, that would be, be beautiful. Quite flattering. Well, we as well. can we can sketch this. We sketch this for you with a cowl. But I love. So, so how does this all? Is that like hand? All hand pieced. Wow, this takes forever. <laughs> I'm really, I'm really excited. And does it get layered sort of in that way? Yes. Well, we hand cut these pieces. You'll right. see, we will be placing the lace on your body, which scale, which piece of lace, oh, nice. where we're putting it. Because it seems just the like, body is, you know, not one proportion. <laughs> it's different here than it is at the waist, right. and it is at the hip, down below, the incredible train. And right. that we will have to bustle for you to be able to really party. Get jiggy on the dance floor. Yeah. I'm about that. There will be a mannequin literally made of your body from the first time that Suhaila actually takes her measurements and creates the dummy. Yeah. All the way through to the end. Couture is such a very, very special process. This is so I'm exciting. I'm so excited for you. We were at a party and I was with a girlfriend who was like, oh my God, who's that guy? He's so cute. So I bring them over and I go to the bathroom. And I come back and she's like, he was talking okay, about you the Vancouver, whole time. Yeah. So then I was like, no, I'm not talking to him. That's so rude. And I went to another place. He happened to end up, as I was leaving, grabbing the door of the cab. He was like, Sabrina, where are you going? And I was like, that was it. Wow. And then that, that was it. It really did feel like destined. But the day before, someone's parking meter was running out and I saw the parking attendant come up That's and I put a quarter in for them. And I was like, oh my gosh, just because I put the quarter in the meter. And you get Idris Elba for a quarter? I'm Jealous. convinced it's that quarter. I don't know a bride 
that doesn't know who she is by the final choice. And out of all the dresses that you look at, yeah. in the end, you know the one that's just right for you. That's oh. kind of incredible.